LibreOffice versus OpenOffice. So if you're looking for alternative software for Microsoft Office while working from home, then look no further because you've got both LibreOffice and OpenOffice at your doorsteps. Although both were great and free software, but you might get confused when choosing between the two. So after watching this video, you'll discover more about the comparison between these two and which one is way better. So without more delay, let's begin. Platform Availability While LibreOffice and OpenOffice are both comparable to Microsoft Office, but without the associated premium payment. While both can be used on all platforms, still, OpenOffice has a slight edge by just a hair over LibreOffice, for it provides additional third-party ports and distributions like the Android port. So the first winner, OpenOffice. User-Friendly UI Next, when it comes to being user-friendly, LibreOffice and OpenOffice both have easy-to-use interfaces. But LibreOffice looks very much like Microsoft Office. It has large icons on the menu ribbon that makes it easier to find what you need. On the other hand, OpenOffice has smaller menu icons and resembles the way a lot like Google Docs. All in all, both have interfaces that are simple and easy to use. But LibreOffice would be the best choice since we're looking for a Microsoft Office alternative built-in features. Actually, both LibreOffice and OpenOffice have a feature that allows you to create different types of document files. It could be either a text document, a presentation, or a database. Although the two comes with free document templates, we'll give another point to LibreOffice, for it provides more built-in and ready-to-use templates than OpenOffice. File Format Compatibility while both these two let you save documents in a wide array of formats, LibreOffice got to top this category, since it offers more modern format options for saving documents. And in contrast, OpenOffice tends to lean towards older file formats. So due to having a more modern file format range, the winner with compatibility, LibreOffice. Overall, it seems obvious that the winner would be LibreOffice, mainly for its compatibility and interface design that's like Microsoft Office, making it easier to use. And it also provides free access to various templates and tools. So definitely, this would be the best alternative. You've just discovered an amazing topic about LibreOffice versus OpenOffice. And now click this, and let's see the next amazing topic.